y'all welcome or welcome back in today's video i will be blow drying my hair using the timo air hype high speed hair dryer this hair dryer has three heat settings and three speed settings it also has a cool shot and it comes with this nice duster bag i'll be starting out on freshly washed and deep conditioned hair for my heat protectant i will be using a hair serum that timo sent me I'm just adding a small amount to the palm of my hands and applying it to each section before I begin. When I initially used this blow dryer, the first thing that I noticed is how quiet it is. And it is quiet, but powerful. I was able to get through my hair much faster than usual. Listen to how quiet this blow dryer is. I'm using the medium heat setting and medium speed to blow dry my hair and I'm using the comb attachment initially and working in small sections. So my hair is split off into four sections but I usually like to split those four sections off into two sections before blow drying. I also like to use the tension method by using one of my hands to keep my hair stretched out just to speed up the process a little bit and so that I'm not using that much heat on my hair. I also really like that this blow dryer isn't bulky so it fits perfectly in my hands and it's not uncomfortable for me to do my hair. I have a lot of hair so sometimes my hands can get a little sore. After blow drying my hair with the comb attachment, I like to switch to the concentrated nozzle and use my double sided brush just to really get my ends. And I prefer to use this concentrated attachment rather than just blow drying my hair without it because it really allows the heat to focus on a specific part of my hair and not just blow around everywhere. Now that I'm finished with the first section, I'm going to repeat the exact same steps with the rest of my hair. I also like to use a t-shirt just to dry my hair a little bit because when my hair is dripping with so much water, it kind of reverts back when I'm blow drying. And this blow dryer is blowing out my hair so fast. Usually when I blow dry my hair, I expect to spend about an hour, but so far it's been 15 minutes and I'm almost done with the back half of my head. And again, after using the comb attachment, I'm just going back with my double-sided brush to really get my ends smooth because sometimes that is like the hardest part of blow drying my hair is really grasping those ends. So by using the double-sided brush, it allows me to get my entire head with ease. I blow dry my hair a little bit differently in the front just because it's low porosity so when my hair is sitting in clips it's just collecting water so it's dripping so much so I go ahead and use the tension method and blow my hair out in that entire section at first just to dry up some of that water before splitting it into my two sections and finishing the blowout. And to clarify with the exception of my dyed ends all of my hair is low porosity 
but since I get to the back faster I don't have to worry about it dripping as much as I do with the front since it's sitting in those clips for a while before I get to it. So far, my hair is feeling really soft to touch because this blow dryer has negative ions. It works to kind of smooth down your cuticles as you're blow drying. That way your hair doesn't dry out and have that sort of rough feeling, like how you can feel your cuticles standing up as you rub up your hair shaft. With this, I don't feel that at all and I'm not experiencing a lot of frizz. Okay, so we're on the last section of hair and my arms don't feel like noodles, so that's a great sign. After I'm finished with the last section, I like to go back over my head just really quickly with the blow dryer and then I am all finished and I am feeling these results. Of course, I still have my volume with my hair blown out, but it's very smooth. I was able to get my roots really well. And with this blow dryer being a fraction of the price of some other high-tech blow dryers out there on the market, I am very impressed. I will leave more information about this blow dryer down in the description box. And I really hope you all enjoyed this video. If you did, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. And I'll see you all in the next video. Bye.